Yo, what's up guys, from Boxy and Legends back with another video. In this tutorial, we're basically going to be making a part in Roblox. That's basically like a trap. So this part will basically like compose. It will be composed of a script. And inside the script, we'll script that basically the part, like if a player touches the part, they lose like the part of whatever they touch. Like for example, let's say that their arm is, is touching the part, right? They're going to lose their arm then but they have all of their other body parts still. So basically that's what we're gonna be scripting today. We're gonna be scripting basically a trap. And to start off, let's put a part on studio obviously. And let's make it so the player can like touch it. Like this side. And let's design it too. So how about we make it like green and we change it to, what was that thing called? Crack lava, yeah, like this. Like this looks nice and this people could tell it's like a trap. Now what we're going to do is we're going to anchor it, then let's add a script, and we're going to start scripting now. So the first thing we're going to type in this thing is, we basically got to declare a variable, right? So what we're going to type for the variable is we're going to call it trap, okay? So we're going to call local trap, we're going to type that, equals to the part, so that's script.parent. Alright, so we got a variable set up now, right? Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna declare a function called local function on touch, right? Let's name it on touch, and I already typed that. And inside, let's put object touch. All right. So after we made the function, just hit enter, and now the function is set up. Now after that, we gotta connect the function. So we're gonna type trap. That's our part, right? That touched. And then call in connect and then we're gonna put on touch so that the function's gonna work all right so after we connect the function like what we did down here what we gotta do now is we gotta um script we gotta script the function now and i'm gonna show you right now so now i got the function set up what we're gonna type in inside the function is we're gonna type object touched this part over here and then destroy with the column then parentheses and now pretty much like I was saying if a player touches the part with his arm only then he's gonna lose the arm he or she however if the person like touches with a lot of stuff then they'll probably just die so this could be like a multi-purpose brick like for example it could be like a trap and a kill brick and I'm gonna show you right now all right so let's start we we're gonna go in and you see over here, this is the part, right? If I touch it with my arm, I'm going to lose the arm. And I'm show you right now. And apparently I touched everything, so I died. But like you saw that, the, let's see, I'm going to go to the part again. I'm going to try touching real quick, then dipping. So let's see, like this. You see that I, I touched it like a little bit, but, and I lost my um hand and my hood, I think. But however, if I jump to it, like full with my entire body, then I'm surely going to die. So like I was saying, this brick could solve, it could be like used as multi-purpose. You could use it for multiple reasons. And there's also a lot of things you could use this brick for. For example, an obby game, or if you're trying to make a killer like Piggy, then you could put in the humanoid root part of it, and then it'll just end up killing people when they touch it. Or losing parts like... You see right here, I lost my arm when I touched it. But anyways, guys, this is how you make a trap in Roblox Studio. That basically takes away players' parts and stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. And if you do, please like, subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.